All right, guys. Well, I'm in my spare room right now, as you can see with all the Hot Wheels and shit hanging up. Uh, it has been far too cold out to be working on the car. I'd like to be, but with it being 25, 30 below zero degrees Fahrenheit at night, uh, no, it's not gonna happen. Uh, we get maybe a high of zero right now, if we're lucky. So I'm not trying to fire up the heater and use all my propane in one night. Uh, but I did find some old uh, footage from 2016. If that tells you anything about how long this car has been apart. Far too fucking long. But uh, from 2016 when I was still tearing it apart. Uh, I was getting the hydraulics figured out on how I was going to plumb or run the front end, front suspension. And while I was doing that, uh, my buddies Bob and Marco were cleaning and painting the 4.6 for Marco's 85 Lincoln Town Car, which if you go look in my older videos, there's a couple of videos of him three-wheeling it and hopping it. But uh, in the video, in this time lapse, it's a, uh, they clean up that mo engine for it to paint it and uh, that'll be, like I said, that'll be going in his 85 town car. It came out of a running driving 2005 Crown Vic police interceptor. And we got the engine, transmission, rear, well, uh, he's not using the rear axle, but he's using the disc brakes off it. And I think he's using the 323 gears out of it. Uh, the car is a frame off. We took and uh, boxed the frame with quarter inch steel, all four sides, front to back. And come spring, we'll be putting the, dropping the engine and transmission onto the frame, getting all the fuel lines and brake lines and all that stuff ran. But I know we gotta add a couple, I think we gotta add a couple of supports or brackets to it and figure out the battery rack uh, mounting for it before we can drop the body back on. Right now we got the body on it, but it's just sitting on there just to keep it all together and out of the way. But if you guys want to see more of that, let me know. Because um, I will video that if people will actually want to see that. Um, but yeah, the dart has been apart for probably six years now. And it all started with the right rear leaf spring hanger mount area being completely rotted out which I found after I found a pinhole in the gas tank as it was leaking gas. So after finding those two things, it just completely snowballed and it is still apart. But it is slowly going back together, which hoping to have most of the rust fixed this year and have it as a complete roller again. But you guys will be seeing all that as I will be videoing that from here on out. And hopefully it'll warm up here in the next few weeks so I can actually start working on it again. I did find a, or borrow a sheet metal brake so I can fab up a couple patch panels I need to make. Um, but if it warms up here, I will do a couple videos on the Lowrider 5th Avenue and the limo again. I know there's a few guys that are interested in seeing those. Uh, but yeah, let me know what you guys think. I know this time-lapse video ain't much, but it's just uh, some lost footage I forgot that I had. So let me know what you think. Uh, like and subscribe, and we'll see you later.